learned something this week. I've learned that we don't always recognize the value of something until it's a memory. And man, what memories I leave with. Reinforcing how fortunate I've been to work here with these people. Right now, at this moment in time, we need smart, objective journalists, a description of my colleagues. And my departure is not going to change that. I leave loving this job, but ready for change. So does Cheryl. I wish you a seamless transition. Send a lot of love and limitless success. Mark, even after all these years, I am amazed by your quick wit, even when it gets you and us into trouble. <laughs> Cheryl Scott, oh, so accomplished. Our connection immediate when you joined our team. And to those men in my life, my TV husband, Alan, who has been my rock, my partner, in all things news for the better part of 28 years, he is smart, he is funny, he is genuine, and quite simply, the best. To my sons, Cole and Matthew, who never once complained when I couldn't make a school event or had to stay late at work, and now are grown men and make me so very proud. And to my husband, Doug, who has been unfailingly supportive, even though we spent a decade plus on opposite sides of the clock. Honey, that changes starting tomorrow. And my final thanks goes to all of you. We've spent a lot of time together the past 28 years. I won't see you on TV anymore, but if you run into me at the grocery or on the street, please stop and say hello. We may never have met, but I do know, after all these years, we definitely are friends. So friend, thank you, and good night. I get this all. Right. <laughs> I just love how you did it your way, Kat.